live by. It's time to go to the <laughs> Columbiana County Fair. Michelle is here to talk about the events going on. Fairs, as always, you're going to have food again this year at the fair? <laughs> we are going to have, you might find some fair food this year, yeah. Yeah. We have a lot of new vendors actually this year popping in, so I'm excited for that. I don't have details on which ones, but I do know, because I don't want to leave anyone out, but there are some new ones as well as some favorites. I imagine you get something deep fried everywhere around fairgrounds, probably. Yeah? Yes. <laughs> as long as I can find french fries, I'll be a happy guy at the fair. And you really have an action-packed week. I mean, things are just, the schedule is just full, really. Yes. Well, Monday, we'll start our fair on our opening ceremony start mm -hmm. at six o'clock. So that's the kickoff, you know, of our fair. And we'll have a nice parade with our junior fair and our fair royalty coming through on our homemade. Well, we've got some custom made shuttles that some of our sponsors donated last year. So those are nice. So they'll be riding on those in the parade. All right. Admission for the fair. Is it? $10 this year? $10 at the gate on mm -hmm. Tuesday through Sunday, and that includes rides. Monday is preview day, so we only charge $6 because there's no rides that day. Oh, okay. Well, what about the, grand, the grandstand shows? Are those included in with that too? Well, a lot of them are, but on Wednesday night, it, we do have an additional fee of $5 for the rodeo. And on our Friday and Saturday night tractor pulls, we have a $10 reserved or bleacher seat and our Sunday night demo derby is a ten dollar seat. All right. But all in all a lot of stuff going on. Well you remember mentioned the junior fair board. The the kids, they're a big part of the fair and what they do and they're there every day. Yes. They have been actually here already a lot of the time getting preparing the benches that they set all those out this year. They've pressure washed things, painted things, they've They've done a lot of work preparing also for this year's fair. Oh, you made it pretty for this year, mm -hmm. huh? Yeah, it's pretty. There's stuff all the time. Are there pig races every day? Did I see that? This is our first year for pig races. And actually, oh. I talked to the gentleman this morning because I wanted to get a little more info because I wanted to let everyone know since it is new. They will be having them every day. He plans on having them like at five and eight and... Hmm. There is a lot of audience participation, he says. So oh. it's called All American Pig Racing, and he does have some stories, patriotic stories he includes with his show. So I'm I'm included. I'm excited to watch it myself. Wow, the inaugural year for it. So be a part of Exciting it. Stuff. And you had yeah. something you wanted to know about Marianne. What was that you asked me? I think it was the event that Sunday night. It's, I saw it on the schedule. The Dog Derby. The demo derby, the it's presented by Derby Dog. Oh. That is the company presenting it. But we do have a dog show on our midway that's free entertainment. It's called Ready Go Dog, and it is all rescue dogs. And they were oh. here last year, and they were fantastic and requested by many to come back. So we're excited for that also. They do put shows on daily also. Wow. Anything with animals. We like that. Yeah. And plenty of animals out there. The auction, when's that happen? A couple of days, isn't it? Yes. We have our Thursday auction is the Junior Fair Steer, the Dairy Promotion Cheese Sale, and the Dairy Beef Feeder Sale. But it starts off with our Best Berry Pie auction, which those are... Yes, those are those those are pretty good, <laughs> and we do have some. Wow. Yeah, they they go for some pretty good dollars. These best berry pies down here, but that starts off that auction, and then Saturday morning at 9 a.m. we have our other livestock. It begins with the goat and fudge baskets, then the lambs, the hogs, turkeys, rabbits, and poultry. That's the line. Fudge. You get fudge. You can get uh, cheese. All mm -hmm. kinds of good things there at the oh, fair. Yummy. Well, well, the and, if you, and if you haven't purchased or been an auction buyer before at our fair, you can sign up that morning to be, you know, to get your number if you're not a established buyer. So that's something. And we also have an online auction. You can look at our website and check that out. And next so, week it'll be hooked up. So everyone can get involved if they want to. Yes. 
All right. So what's going on? It is it's a seven day fair, isn't it? It is a seven day fair. Yeah. So Sunday through day. Sun, well, Monday through Sunday. Yeah. All right. So get involved. Admission, 10 bucks, as you said, then additional maybe for some of the grandstand shows. But all the other stuff, man, all kinds of fun things going on. Happened right outside of Lisbon or actually in Lisbon, the Columbia mm -hmm. County Fair going on. It's the end of the month and into end of the month of August, too. So get involved, Michelle. Hey, thanks, thanks a lot Michelle. for hanging with us. This Thank morning. You're welcome. Thank you.